Crime and punishment. Here we go. Nico! <laughs> Roman! What are you doing in the dumpster, man? Are they there? What are you talking about? Get out of there, man! I'm freaking out, man! I'm being followed! I saw them! Don't be ridiculous! You're being paranoid! I'm be... Fuck you! Fuck you! Everything was fine, and then you show up! And now we're dead! Because Faustin is a psychopath! He's going to kill us! Because we killed Vlad! Vlad was his man! That's how it works! You kill their guy, they kill you! Roman! Get out of there, man! Listen to me. Vlad was a piece of trash. They don't care about him. All they care about is making money. So, we say we work for them. Now get out of there, you smell like cabbage. I don't want to, man. I'm shitting myself! Oh! Get out of the dumpster, Mr. Fat Man! Come on, Jeez. man. The boss wants a little chat. Pulls up an AK. No warning, nothing. Straight up, just bam, right to the face. Uh, 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 Wake oh. up! <laughs> <laughs> we had to gag him to stop the screaming. You shouldn't have brought them here, Andre. Why not? <laughs> You'll be the bad boy, Mr. Balkan. And the boss is not happy. Oh no, I <laughs> shit my pants. Not yet, but you will. Who are you working for? Uh, my cousin, Roman. <laughs> an idiot. That's not good enough. I'm gonna saw off your fucking arm. Speak! Okay, okay. Your dad likes it up the ass. What do you want me to say, huh? <laughs> Very funny. Do you think you're so smart? <laughs> no! I'm tied up in the basement a long way from home, while some ape threatens me with a hacksaw. So no, I'm not that smart. Shut the fuck up! My fucking wife is watching television! <laughs> Good lord. What are you doing? Nothing. I mean, I was finding out who he is. And? Who is he? He is his cousin. You were about to cut up some guy in my house, making all that noise to find out he's his cousin. <laughs> Where did you find this idiot? He was a friend of your sergeant when we were in Vladivostok. He's an imbecile. So, Nico Berry, you think it's okay to kill my employees? If he is an asshole, yes. Do it! Oh. I agree. <laughs> Asshole, look at me like I'm a piece of shit. Bozomoy. Now listen, Nico Belli. You are very lucky Blood was an idiot. The only reason I keep him around is because I fucked his sister. Look at me. You owe me. I got some dickheads in my neighborhood trying to run a shipment, yeah? And we found a buyer for the TVs. Yes, a buyer. But you got to get them for us so we can make the sale. Can you untie Roman? Хорошо. Help! Shut up, Roman! Help! Roman, shut up! Help! Shut up, Roman! Shut up, Roman! Shut up! Roman, shut up! Roman, shut up! Roman, shut up! Roman, shut up! Shut up! Stop shooting people, you maniac! My wife doesn't like when people shout! Whatever! You better get those screens soon! Or I will personally pull your cousin's stitches out! One by one, and watch his guts spill onto the floor! Clean this shit up! Listen, we'll take care of your cousin, but you better get the police car. And then you call me. Roman, Roman! Go, go, go! I, I'll take care of him. Fuck! <laughs> Honestly, Roman's an idiot. He had what was coming to him. Alright, find a cop car. How do I do that? How do you want me to find a cop car? Oh, look. Cop car. That's it. It's my lucky day. Oh, 
unfortunately, he left his car in here. I mean, he left his door open. I have the police car. What now? The van is driving around South Broker. Pull it over, take it to our lockup on Duke's Drive. Be more specific. How many vans do you think there are in South Broker? That is a problem for you and your cousin. Not me. Keep pulling vans over until you find the TV. Goodbye. Alright, so I gotta go find this guy. Let's go here. Let's see. PD. Sorry, go here. Just gotta floor it. I need some health and some armor. Oh, way too fast. Way too fast. Thought I was gonna go flying off. Seems like I found the van. Alright, slow down. Take a right. I do a move. There, you're fucking dead. I got nothing you went in the town. Show me you don't got any flat streets in the back. Hey, you got bad information, brother. Man, get out of here. All right, I don't know why you're pushing. That's not how things work. Gotta go to the other ones. Let's see who's next. This guy's pretty close. Real slow, shithead. You're making a mistake. We're paying protection money to Kenny Petrovic. Are you carrying a shipment of TVs? You're gonna be sorry. Wrong move, asshole. Who? Oh, that was close. I need some, I need a hot dog real quick. Alright, finally here. Let's, um, I'm trying to, this game is picking up, but it's taking its time. I don't like it. Right, I need a hot dog vendor. Like, but I think it's raining. No, 
I don't need car wash, I don't need any of that. Let's see where I gotta go. Dimitri. I've left the van where you say. How's Roman? He's okay. A little scarred, but okay. You did good. Mikhail needs someone like you. Stop by and see him sometime. Alright, hey, that's all good. Oh, you know what? Let me go see what's good to Michelle. Hi there, it's me, Nico. Are you doing anything? You want to meet up? Yes, I'm not doing anything. Interesting. Pick me up in an hour. That is good news. See you soon. Are you all right? I was just shot in the stomach. So boring. And then stitched up in the doctor's office that was dirtier than the basement we were nearly tortured in. So great. You sound calm, actually. That Dimitri guy gave me some painkillers. I'm kind of out of it. If you're near a shop, can you pick up some adult diapers for me? See you later, Nico. Hmm. All right. Well, let's go see what Michelle's up to. Let's go. Hey, I... What? I'm really feeling bored today. Let's go to this one though. I prefer the other car. New pants, very nice. So, thanks for taking me out again. No problem. Yeah, I've never dated a foreign guy before. A lot from another planet, but none from another country. Okay. Tell me about yourself. Tell me about Nico Bella. There is not much to tell. I just moved here. I know, and you live with your cousin. What do you guys do? I don't have regular work yet. So, what did you do in Europe? I work in tourism, in travel industry. Did you fight in the war? Sure. How was that? How do you think it was? Seeing your friends die, seeing men have their legs blown off, it was, it was, it ruined me. I'm so sorry. Me too. Maybe here, things will be different. Okay. All right, let's go. Let's get some drinks. Calculating route. Calculating route. In 400 yards. Interesting bar. Do you think those guys were crooks? I don't know about that kind of thing. What the hell? How am I? So, uh, did you drink in there? I could swear it was just me knocking back that stuff. Shit, I do not know. I cannot really remember. You are a strange girl, Michelle. A funny girl. I do not know. Avenue, yes? Would you please put the radio on another station? That's uh, very kind of you. So can you take me to Mohawk Avenue, yes? Thanks a lot. Get that thing moving! You going to
want to invite me in? Sure. I like you. But let's be careful. Make sure no one gets burned. Great. Oh, hey, listen. I respect you. <laughs> hey. You're special. Ah, oh, tell me interesting things. Oh, Nico, I really like you. I think she likes me. Hey, Nico. Hey. Come in. Thank you. Lay off that stuff. Why? Because it clouds your judgment. Not now, it's not the time. My judgment. That's a good one. I'm a fool. Drunken fool. Nico's here. We're going to go take care of that guy. I take it you won't be joining us? Make him suffer. People forget pain so quickly. You need to calm down with that stuff. Calm? Why? So I can be like you, Mr. Barbitrid? Always so fucked up on painkillers, you don't give a shit. You need to calm down. <laughs> Where would we be now if I was calm like you? Let me guess. In a prison camp in Siberia, or selling hash to tourists in Red Square, or still in the Navy. Which is it today? Be careful, Dimitri. Be fucking careful. You be careful. You're getting crazy. That's the way it works. I am angry. You are calm. I scare you reason. It works. Yes, but you've angered the wrong people. Blah, blah, too many blah, bodies, blah, too much blah, attention blah, blah, will be blah. dealt with if we don't start playing by the rules. I've angered people. Me? Not we. Strange. When I give out the money, it's us. When I have to push people, it's me. All alone. Don't think I cannot see through you. After all we've done together. You're getting delusional. Look, we have to go. I fucking love you. Yes, yes. I fucking love you. I know Yes. This. But you treat me like a child. I run things my way. Dimitri Raskolov, my fucking way! Get out of my sight! Or I fucking kill you! I'm not saying don't run things your way. I'm saying be calm. Here. Take a couple of these. What are you still doing here? I said, get out of my sight! <laughs> Ooh, C300, let's go. We're going to that shop. This guy been making porn now in his basement, and he didn't cut Mikhail in. At least he could have done it, sent over some tapes. You know how much money there is in selling this stuff online? A whole fucking heap. We're going to ignore what Mikhail said, and try not to kill them. Taking a bite of this pie would be very profitable for our operation. I got no problem with sparing some lives. No, it's Mikhail that has that issue. Can't keep his finger off of the triggers. Wasn't always like this, though. Things got to him. I hope it don't get to me. Alright. We're already here. It's awesome. This city has so many opportunities for men like me. Verna! 
Where's your boss? What do you mean? He's, uh... In the back? No, 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 he's... He better not be filming. Uh, no, they're just having a meeting, I swear. Get out of the way! <clears throat> Fuck. You see? They don't make them like that no more. That's a vintage bush. If it wasn't for that, I'd say this weren't worth transferring to DVD. Hey, Joseph! You think you can expand your business interests, make these pornos and sell them, whoa, and whoa, we won't know about it, we huh? We just wait until the uh, books was closed at the end uh, of the financial year. Then we was gonna cut you Your in. books are closed until you pay us our cut. Nico, take this and cover Joseph. All right. We ain't making that much cash. It's not a fact. Listen, big guy, you got a great look going on. Real strong. We can put you in one of our films. Shoot this scumbag in the leg. Hey, man, please, go easy on me. Come on, big guy. Shut this dickhead up, Nico. Oh, oh, right oh, God, man. I was just trying to be friendly. Shit, he'll be out of action for a couple of weeks. You got some money for Mr. Faustin? Fine, here you go. We ain't gonna have the re You should have thought of that earlier. Please don't hurt me! I'm an actor! This is a mess. Let's get out of here. And we're going to an alleyway off of Dillon Street and shop. <laughs> I want to buy you a present. Will you wrap it up and put a pretty bow on it? Screw you. We're seeing a friend of mine. He's got a good line of weapons. It's on the ground. A back room place. There are a few around the city. The mayor has a real hard on for gun control. Guns don't seem that controlled. I've seen plenty and I just got here. And now you'll know where to get them for yourself. What's the problem? Я знаю, что ты это не имел в виду. Все в порядке. I didn't kill Joseph. We will make more money with him alive. Черт, Михаил! Михаил! Fuck! You're lucky. Ramadan tried to make you kill someone every two seconds. is just down that alleyway. You got what you like. Tell them to put it on Mr. Faustin's account. All right, we have to choose some. You can buy weapons from various gun stores throughout the right. city. Look like a cop. To each weapon, see which are currently available. The new stock has always been located whenever. Uh, check back soon, the deal. Oh, he wants me to get this, eh? Alright. I'll take this one. Charge Mr. Faustin. You fucking Ruskies are milking me dry. I ain't a cow. I ain't Russian. I swear I thought you were. Drive us to Mr. Faustin's. So, you and Mr. Faust, have you always argued and made up like this? It wasn't always like this. Mikhail was a great man. He had a temper, but he was fair. Now he blows his top at the slightest thing. I never know who he will shoot, who he will stab. Andrei, who you met in Mikhail's basement, he was always loyal. He was a good worker. Now he's dead. I guess that, that is why we need your help. Remind Faustin of that. Maybe then he will not try to kill me. This guy lives in a gated community, like, come on. The 
Thank you for your help, Nico. Come to see us at the club soon. Mikhail will be cool by then. All right. Nico, catch you soon. Oh, yeah. Let's see what he says. Yeah, I'm busy. Come about.